Hey, what's up everybody? Sebastian from Mimal, and today I'm gonna to be taking you through how to set up and take care of your small mealworm colony. So it's pretty simple to set them up. You really only need a few things, but you still wanna make sure you do it right. So first things first, you'd wanna get a clean plastic tub that is a good size for the amount of mealworms that you would be keeping. So this one is just 21 inches long by 13 inches wide and three inches high. So you really only need a tub that's like two to three inches high just to make sure that they don't get out and that should be fine for them. And then after that, you just need some wheat bran substrate. So they will use this as substrate and they will also eat this at the same time. So once we have everything we need, then we can start setting them up. Okay, so now we can start setting them up in their new bin. So first you want to grab the wheat bran and you want to pour in a decent amount of it just so they have enough room to burrow under and just live in. Not too much, but definitely not too little. Spread it out so it's covering the entire floor of the bin. Maybe get a little more. So that should be good. So again, like I said, this is substrate, but they are also going to be eating it. So you wanna make sure that it's always available to them because after a week or two of living in, in the bin with this with the original wheat bran, that's gonna start going away as they eat it and their poop kind of looks the same as the wheat bran. So you want to just keep an eye on that to make sure that what they have is actually the wheat bran and not just that they're laying in their poop. So next you want to take your mealworms, whether in a box or container or whatever, and just take them and you just pour them in just like that. And like I said, there's about two to 3,000 in here. They should be fine living in here. And I, you can spread them out if you want, but they'll find their way around and they'll most likely start burrowing. But if there's a lot of them, then they'll always be on top for the most part. So after that, they have their food, they have their bin. They're basically good to go at this point. The only thing you also need is you will need either carrots or some kind of fruit like apples just for hydration. So just to make sure, cause they're not gonna just drink water. So these carrots will give them a night, enough water for them to survive and basically just thrive. So every couple of days, whenever you see that the carrots are running out, just cut up a, another piece or two and just throw it in there and they'll be good to go. And basically after that, you just want to make sure it's clean, make sure the wheat bran is fresh and good. And basically that is everything that you would need to know to start setting up and taking care of a small mealworm colony. And that is how you easily and quickly set up your small colony of mealworms. So if you have any questions or suggestions about the care and setup please leave them down in the comments below and if you enjoyed the video please like and subscribe and thanks for watching everybody have a good one